Um, yeah. OK, let's say tomorrow night I, I do my usual Halloween party trick and I dress up as, say, Dracula. Am I culturally appropriating Transylvania? Well, no, because Dracula is a well-known, you know, vampire mythological creature. It's... From Transylvania? It's... It, Dracula's different. Dracula is literally a cartoon, you know... It's not? It's... What else is a cartoon? It's a myth. It's what else is a cartoon? Dracula's a vampire. Do you know what I mean? Like, what this is Halloween. We're allowed, to, we're allowed to dress up as vampires. Yeah. And what I'm saying, what I believe in is culture appropriation. So, for me, dressing up as someone like Moana is very different to dressing up as Dracula on Halloween. Explain why. Just give us your so, thinking on this. Basically, so Moana is based on Polynesian cultures in the South Pacific. Um, these are cultures that have faced oppression and discrimination today. They've had their lands taken away from them, and today there is still racial prejudice and discrimination against these people. And so so to dress up in their, you know, their native dress and use it as a costume, that's just mockery. It's offensive Julian? and it's, it's disrespectful. You're a very intelligent lady. I've read your, your, your articles for many years, but I worry that... I, I think this is certifiably insane. I genuinely think... And it would be funny if yeah. it wasn't so dangerous. This constantly seeing of everything in the, in the, through the prism of, of race all the time. You know, the Polynesians... OK, maybe some Polynesians in the past have had a rough time, or maybe they're having it now. Native Indians, black people, white people in Britain probably had a pretty rough time when the Vikings invaded. I mean, the Romans that's very invaded. different to oh, racial very di Of slavery. course it's very different. Right. Of course it's like Dracula's very different. My daughter is white. If she dresses up as Elsa, she's dressing up as a character from a film that she really likes. She's 10 now. She'd think that was really uncool. If she dressed up as Moana, which she wasn't planning to do, but she will be now, mm -hmm. um, that, wouldn't be that wouldn't be her mocking or, or, or in any way... Um, a, being disrespectful to Polynesian culture. That would be her dressing up as a brilliant, strong female role model from a film. My daughter doesn't see colour because she's not been raised to see colour. Most children uh, don't see colour. And, and you're me, telling them they should. No, I'm not at all. I'm saying they need to be aware. Like, uh, Why? I, I wish we could live in an idealistic world where colour and race wasn't an issue. That would be wonderful, but we don't. And so it is important that but at some point children become aware of this. People are confused by, by the two arguments being presented right. as twin arguments. On the one hand, the little girls can't dress up as a Polynesian because that's racist. <laughs> On the other hand, they can't dress up as somebody of their own ethnicity, a, a, a white princess, because that's superior. That's so, a... to me, I'm, I'm going to say I, that's kind of where I draw the line. I don't agree so much with um, the writer on this point. Her I'm dressing point, up as a, as a yeah, white princess. Yeah, I, I just... I just, I mean, for her, her argument was that it's the white beauty standard and that Elsa with her blonde hair, blue eyes, is promoting the idea that that's What beautiful. about the other princess? She wasn't blonde. Are we allowed um, to dress up as the sister? I mean, I mean, to me, I, do you know what, that, that's a different argument. What I think is a problem is cultural appropriation. That is about beauty standards and, you know, we see that with everything but everywhere. But about appropriation implies in some way theft, as if in some way dressing up as a character from a film is in any way stealing someone's culture or disrespecting... It's not stealing it, it is uh, That's what appropriation it. means. Exactly. It's, it's, How it's, is it it's, it's celebrating, if, if anything, it's celebrating that culture. But, Julia, like, you know, you're not from those cultures and so... Oh, the, I oh, I'm, oh, I've, made the, oh I've made the terrible no. error of being white, therefore what I'm not I'm allowed saying an opinion. Is that it's just That's about the rule being now, empathetic isn't it? and trying to put yourself in these people's shoes and thinking, how and would thinking, you feel do you if think, you've gone through Do you think the people of Polynesia and have how been would you horrified think that by that mocked? I have no, you I know, think they couldn't I'm sure less. it's completely different for different people, but at the, at the end of the that's day, what really, it's about, it's about point. being polite and respectful. Do you honestly think that the Polynesian Islanders give a flying fig about that Disney film? I'm, I I've, bet they don't. I have I read articles that they saying don't. that for them, they see these like planes coming with big pictures of Moana, and people just assume everyone there is basically Moana. To an, you know, I'm not saying Do it's going to be the biggest issue in their lives, but that is going to, I'm, you know, it's it's disrespectful and it's a mockery. Well, and well, then we must leave it. Sticky <laughs> yeah, uh, thank you very much, both.